Hello there. So, as promised, I'm going to do a quick tutorial, a very quick tutorial. Uh, I'm just between students at the moment, so I thought I'd stick this one in. Raindrops keep falling on my head, which I played yesterday on this. Um, yesterday's thing that I did, I actually detuned it by a fret, but I put it back up to concert pitch. So, um, this is normal tune. You can play along with the actual record, it'll sound right. Now, before we start, I want you to take a look at these chords. Okay, they're the shapes that we're going to play, so take a snapshot of that. All right, nothing too complicated there. So there's that one, and then for the middle section, we've got this one. My nose looks like the Mersey Tunnel. <laughs> you think that's bad? You want to see my brother's nose? Christ. All right, so that's that one for the middle section. All right, so. It's pretty straightforward. Now, I'm going to keep the rhythm simple. There's only two main rhythms on a guitar or a ukulele. There's, there's like a straight rhythm, which means you're going to go one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and... And there's what we call a shuffle rhythm, which is one and two and three and four. The shuffle one, imagine that, you know, John Wayne on a horse. It's got that sort of cowboy feel. Whatever it is that, that, that reminds you of John Wayne, that's the shuffle one. All right, anything cowboy sounding. Uh, Raindrops has a shuffle rhythm, all right? So um, when we get to play the whole thing with the full rhythm, then we'll get into that. For now, I'm just going to break it down into your straightforward beats. So the introduction goes... Well, that's my phone. Yes. Hello. Bye. All right, so what chords am I playing for the intro? But to break it down, we've got an F, played with your first finger there and your second finger there, okay? And two beats, one, two. Move to a C, which is your third finger on the first string of the third fret. Three, four. So we're gonna split the bar between those two chords. One, two, three, four. To a B flat, which is the trickiest chord in the whole song. One finger across two strings there. Second finger on the third string of the second fret, and this one up here. And again, split the bar, one, two, and then back to C. So we've got F, C, B flat, C. Now eventually we'll go. And we'll do that offbeat thing. You'll feel that as we go along. So that's the intro. And then we go into the main part of the song, which is F. Again, I'm going to break it down into just the downbeats, starting with F, first finger, second finger, one, two, three, four, F major seventh, sounds difficult, bring off your first finger, one, two, three, four, that's also called A minor on a U, but don't worry about that, um, F seventh, replace the first finger again and put your third finger on the third string of the third fret, one, two, Okay, I'll play those Fs again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'll put them back. One, two, three, four. To B flat, lie this finger across. Put that finger there and your third finger up there. One, two, three, four. So, raindrops keep falling on my head. Just like the guy whose feet are too big for his. And on the word bed, we're going to play a real tricky chord. Okay, it's called the C6. Bed. That's all it is. I was joking, by the way. There's no fingers at all. Two beats on C6. One, two. Two beats on D7, played like this, with your second finger on the uh, fourth string of the second fret. Third finger on the second string of the second fret. So, C6. One, two, three, four. And again. One. So raindrops keep falling on my head, just like the guy's feet are too big for his bed. Nothing seems to fit those. Okay, so far so good. To G minor seventh, which is a bit like the the uh, B flat, but without that finger, so it's a little bit easier. And two bars of this: one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then a C sus or whatever suspended fourth, whatever it is. Little finger on the so third finger on the first string, third fret, 
like a C, and then just put that finger on the on the on the second string of the first fret and go one, two, three, four. It's really nice to put some of those in. They're really nice link chords. So from the G minor seven, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now that's the verse, all of it. So we've got F one. that was done and we've just done that twice all right for verse one and verse two good but there's one thing i know that's the bit we're doing now all right so we've got f but there's one and again same sort of thing just to just do the downbeats one two three four f major seventh one two three four and then to a b flat the same way as before and then to a C okay but there's one thing I know the blues they send to greet me won't de and then two bars of C6 won't defeat me it won't be a long till it's nice that bit then D7 one bar happiness Steps. Remember how we do that with second finger there and your third finger there? One, two, three, four. And then G minor seventh, which is that one there, that one there, a bit like B flat, we'll be that that finger. One, two, three, four. And then we've got the one, two, three, four. That's the B flat to C. B flat to C where it goes. But for now we're gonna go one, two, three, four. I'm gonna just try and sing that bit again. Forgive the old voice voice, it's a bit too high for me in this key. This is the original key. But there's one thing I know the blues they sent to greet me won't defeat me. It won't be long till happiness steps up to greet me. Because I'm free, nothing's worrying. Now let's look at that, it's easy. It's one, two, two beats on the F, two beats on the C sixth, two beats on your G minor seventh, two beats on your C, okay? Nothing's worrying. Nothing's worrying me. Nothing's worrying me. Now, if you wanted to be clever and do the brass bit at the end, that's a, an F to an E flat played like this one there and two there. I wouldn't do that bit. I did it yesterday because I'm trying to be clever. You know, and I don't even think I was that clever when I just heard it back, but it wasn't bad. But uh, you really need to play those bits. So that was a very quick run through of raindrops keep falling on my head, which I hope you enjoyed. What time is it now? Uh, 10 minutes. Um, tell you what I'll do. Uh, no, I won't. I was going to try and find it on the, uh, on the computer, but the computer's behind me and I'll have to lean over you and I can't be bothered. Um, so enjoy that. I will see you next time. Um, I'm going to do, I think, you know, Moon River. The proper version of Moon River. 
great, you know, um, what was the film it's from? I don't know. But it's a fantastic yeah, this. This one, hold on. Me trying to learn this, I've just been working it out. version next i've got to learn it first okay so i hope you've enjoyed that catch you next time bye for now